Welcome back to AP Precalculus in under three minutes. No time for intros, let's get into it. Okay, so this is the topic that people start hating logs over. I will try my best to be civilized and present this as easily as I can. Everything you have learnt from this unit, exponential functions, different properties to do with exponents, inverse relationships, and finally logarithmic function properties, all of that culminates into one thing, a very intimidating looking question to solve. This one specifically was taken from the 2024 AP Precalculus exam, so let's go over it together. First, I'm going to use the product property on the first two terms. Then I will use the quotient property, which is just the opposite of the product property, on the other term. Now I'll multiply the numerator using the product property. Then I'll divide using the quotient property, which is just the opposite of the product, and I'll get my fully simplified answer. I guarantee you, you will get a question like this on the AP exam. Remember your properties, and you'll be fine, I promise. And remember, the way to solve for inverse functions, even when talking about logs, is to swap the x and the y into solve for y. Also, so if you ever have two solutions to a log function, you need to plug them both back into the original problem because oftentimes you'll find one would be impossible because you can't take a log of a negative number. Don't overthink this. I promise it's not that bad. On the screen now are some AP style questions for this topic. Pause now. I'll put the work and answers on the screen now. I will see you in the next one.